So as far as the newest improvements that we've made on development for our compute sticks here at Intel, we actually have a couple of new, entr new entrances into the market. This one is actually our highest performing compute stick. This is a M5 level of performance for our Core M stick here. It does have a fan on the inside, but you're talking about full ports that we're able to go ahead and put in there. This is actually also vPro. So as far as being able to be managed by your IT, this is something that you can actually deploy across the enterprise, either in desktops or digital signage or whatever usage model you want to put together. Now this other one we have is a full prototype, and this one is actually running on the same platform, a Core M, but also includes a couple of other Intel goodies, including a RealSense camera here, as well as microphone arrays that we have in the, uh, in the sides there. Full USB port, both three and two, and the HDMI out here. So just mount this on top of your TV and you have all the benefits of a RealSense camera, whether it's using gesture or a Windows Hello login. And uh, of course we have the microphone array. So using Cortana or other voice searches, completely possible. And this is something where this one being a prototype type, but really looking for more innovation that we can go ahead and put in these sticks. And of course, working with all of our partners across the board so they can bring their own products with these technologies easily to market. So we're really excited about both of these and uh, you'll definitely be seeing some more news soon. So in addition on our compute sticks, we've also launched an application. It works across all of our compute sticks and it's the Intel keyboard. So you can put it on your mobile devices, whether it's Android or iOS, and have a full keyboard and mouse control and a couple of other extras that you can completely control your stick from any device and from any range over Wi-Fi. So sitting on your couch, I can go ahead and manipulate my Windows 10 PC that's now part of my smart TV appliance, which I think is pretty cool. But we're really excited to see, in addition, how people are using utilities like that, as well as developers doing more innovative form factors as far as, uh, or interfaces, so you can see software developed directly for this type of interaction.